complexion obvious as well. I think so, because that video is what it all looks like to Trent Green at the moment. You can debate wow. the appropriateness of a quarterback trying to execute a blindside chop block on a 300-pound defensive tackle, either in terms of sportsmanship or common sense. But if you are that 300-pound defensive tackle and you are taunting that quarterback, whether or not he should have hit you that way is no longer really part of the equation. If that quarterback is unconscious and cannot hear you, Yet even that performance from Travis Johnson of the Texans might have been written off as just wasted effort, except that after everybody calmed down and after they strapped Trent Green to a gurney and wheeled him off the field like part of the stage at the Super Bowl halftime show, Mr. Johnson continued to detonate. It was, he said, a malicious hit, he told the reporters afterwards. It was uncalled for. He's like the scarecrow. He wants to get courage while I wasn't looking and hit me in my knee instead of trying to hit me in my head. God don't like ugly. You know what I mean? Actually, Travis, I don't know what you mean, and nobody here seems to either. We rejoin this, Johnson, already in progress. I'm trying to eat just like everybody else, so to hit me like that, that showed me what type of man he was. He was unconscious. <laughs> That's what kind of man he was. Travis Johnson, by unanimous decision, tonight's worst person in the NFL. Uh, and we are happy to report that while we're not uh, trying to trivialize what happened, to Trent Green. It wasn't as serious as it looked with him strapped.